what's up? My name's Stan, and I sell vials of alien cum. I know that's probably not what you wanted to hear when you walked over here. You wanted cum or what? <laughs> Oh my god, I just realized my shit wasn't working. Uh... Alright, so I was saying... I just realized... Oh no, uh... I had to restart this whole game over. It was a fucking bitch, bro. Hey, kid! Another one down, huh? Great work. But, uh, hey, there's something you should see. Take a look after you turn in your bounty. All right, good. Get over here. Check this out. Hello, Blim City citizens. That's Clug Nugman, Blim City magistrate. Working hard to flush out all the crime and drugs from our streets. I'll be the first to admit we haven't made much headway in the fight against the G3 cartel. All right, all right. Now catch us next bit. It's all about to change. We've learned of a bold bounty hunter who's been bravely taking this G3 matter into their own hands. You hear that? He's talking about you. We've it's me. Dealt it's with me. Two of the cartel's most powerful officers. Yeah, you got lucky. I am not Shut too proud ass. to ask for help in our war on drugs. Bounty Hunter, if you're listening, please consider joining forces with the good people of Blim City. I hope you'll choose to come forward and meet with me personally at my office in City Hall. Holy shit, should we go see him? I already told him you go. What? <laughs> no, don't start. Trust me, he's legit. This guy's been anti-G3 since before any of you were even in diapers. Honestly, I don't know if Gatlin's even wear diapers. Head what, through if, there. what if it's a scam? Clug's expecting it. What if it's a scam, bro? Sorry for making the call without you, but the uh, Clug's a good man. I say we hear him out. Where's what's her face, bro? Is this some kind of power play? You trying to make him wait to prove you're the tough one? Hell yeah. Because I kind of respect it. Yeah, man. Sorry for making the call without you, but the uh, Clug's a good man. I say we hear him out. <laughs> So this is your bedroom, huh? It's fine. I mean, I don't, I, don't, I don't really know what I was expecting, to be honest. Fuck you. Come on. You know how hard it is to get a meeting with the magistrate? Don't keep him waiting. Hey. Oh, I have to. I can't go upgrade. Go talk to Clug. Jesus. Oh, fuck. Dirty ass feet. Oh, I thought I was <laughs> listening to. <laughs> oh, sure. Right. Oh. Alright. Okay. Is this supposed to be a Ninja Turtle with the look that? Raphael? What's up, man? Thank you so much for coming, Bounty Hunter. Big it ass wasn't head. really our idea, but hey. Look, I'll cut to the chase. I need your help. You're a human, correct? My men looked into it. Sorry. You survived the G3's attack on your home planet Earth, right? Uh, no. We're Gatlians. Unless you're talking about my personal chauffeur. Of course. Sorry. I'm familiar with your plight as well. It's such a tragedy what happened on Gatlas. It makes much sense that you and the human would join forces but perhaps you have room for one more ally as well? Yeah, I'm sure the big hotshot politician wants blood on his hands. That's precisely why I need your help. I'm having the darndest time curbing the species drug trade. I can only do so much and only within the confines of the law. I mean, I've got my hands full with Gary the Poisoner. He's not just poisoning the water supply, he's moved on to poisoning weirder stuff now, like street lamps. We don't even know how that works. Why does she get actually a, a problem? Maybe it's fine to poison the street other... lamps. I'm a bit overwhelmed, Gun and I wish it. I could focus more That's time weird. on the G3. But you, you've taken out two top G3 officers in less time out? that it takes us to file a single report. 
So you see how you can help me, but there's also one way I can help you. Oh yeah? And how's that? This tool on my desk here will help you rescue your fellow humans. You can use it to teleport them to a safe haven my team has arranged for them to stay at until the G3 are dealt with. Bro, I know your legs gotta be fucking killing you with that big ass head you're holding. Please take a look at this tool! Bitch, who are you yelling at? Um. Sorry, maybe humans have poor hearing. Did you hear me mention this very useful tool? I think it's a trap. He's trying to get all the humans in one spot. That's a trap, bro. That's a okay, trap. you think I don't know what you're doing? I know all about these power plays where you stay quiet and make me wait and just stand there and look like you're not paying attention or your brain just went to the bathroom or something. I know all about it and I absolutely respect it. Where's your ears, bitch? Oh, what the fuck? Whatever. What's the catch? Well, the human species is technically a drug. I can't have dangerous sentient drugs in the hands of my citizens, and you can't have your people getting captured and consumed. This solves both of our problems. Assuming you plan to continue taking out the G3. Yeah, no shit like we're gonna stop now. Then, thank you. Sincerely, you humans and Gatlians, you're both very noble species. This means a lot to me. I've made it my life's work to use my power to help people in need, but even I have my limits. I'm just glad I have someone like you to turn to. As a token of thanks, my team will be feeding any intel we find on the G3 directly to your handler, Mr. Zaruthian. We've already sent him everything we had. The rest is in your hands. Yeah, yeah, whatever. We just like killing freaks. If you want to help, you're more than welcome. That's all I have for you. Feel free to stay as long as you like. The view is breathtaking. I'm gonna say hi. Oh, uh, feel free to stay as long as you like. You said that already. You said that already, bro. You can visit the human haven yourself, by the way. We don't know exactly what makes humans comfortable, but I hope you like how we've set things up. Yeah, I'll check it out, huh? I'll check it out. Check it out. Make sure you ain't doing no funny business, and if you are, Lemonhead, fuck your ass up. All right, we're back. So, <laughs> it went well, huh? I got a message saying they'll hook us up with any G3 <clears throat> intel they find. Yeah, not only that, he gave us a way to save humans. God damn. You got it easy. Nothing as convenient as this ever happened when I was bounty hunting. Hey, uh, speaking of, we should get you a jetpack before you head back out into the field. We're really gonna need it. Head on down to the pawn shop and see if they got one in stock. Oh, and yeah, you might want to hit up Broto's chef stand, too. He's a little shady, but uh, those warp discs he's selling can be pretty helpful. I want to see that place. Hey, you got any uh, jetpacks in stock? A jetpack? Oh, certainly. I can help. Uh, I can help. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> it's literally right there. Nine hundred ninety-nine, huh? Run it. Ah, jetpack, huh? Great choice. Really phenomenal choice. Let's lock that purchase in. Okay, great. So where where's the jetpack? Not so fast. I gotta back order that bad boy. I'll have it ready for you in a couple of days. I promise. No you refunds, serious? by the way. This purchase is final. Fuck! God damn it. Okay, well let's let's just give Gene the update. Are you still looking? Such a wonderful day. You bitch.
Yo, bounty hunter, wanna do some perfectly legal business? Hell yeah. Hey, how you doing? <clears throat> Perfect. Skate park. <laughs> Say it. Excellent. <laughs> See you later, valued food customer. How'd it go? Did you get a jetpack? Yeah, but it's on back order. Great. Perfect excuse for a rest. We're still waiting on Clug's intel anyway. Why don't you go to bed and sleep off some of that excitement? Gene's right. That, that's, that sounds like a good idea. So, uh, what kind of stuff did you do in here? Like, anything gross? Y you have to tell me. Like, seriously, yeah, come on. Like We're right best here? friends now. Has all my jizz right there on it. Hey, good night, partner. I'm just gonna sit right here and watch you fall asleep. I'm really glad we met. You know, I, I think I think we're doing something amazing here. How cool would it be if we actually stopped the G3? Sorry, sorry, I, 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 I'm just, I'm excited. I'll shut up, L let's get some sleep. Pretty soon, you know, we'll be jetpacking across all the space. Sorry, I'm, I'm being too loud. You're probably trying to, let's get you to sleep. What the? All right, partner. Let's take this jetpack for a spin. Can when you make it over that I gap? Get the Holy shit! This rules! Damn, you're just like a TonyHawk.com jetpack bro. Why are you? Why are you in this bathroom? How's the Michael show going? I hate this. What? I hate this. I'm in the bathroom. Have you started being on camera? Yeah. Oh, check out that landing. God damn. What? Oh, there's a wall in there. Oh. Uh... No wiping. Hey, Michael. Yeah. Whatever you're doing, it's working, baby. The ratings, they're shooting up. Well, I gotta tell you, Gene was right. That is gonna come in handy. It's also fun. You can fly while doing combat. It's a very cool uh, feature that we have here. We put a lot of time and effort into it. Let's head back and talk to Gene and see if there's any new bounties. Every Friday. Hey, look at me. I'm the guy who sells stuff. Oh, I'm an illegal shit. concessions guy. I like to sell you illegal stuff over here. Well, it's not the same what's that guy yelling about? Illegal stuff? Is he talking to us? Here's what's up. My name's Stan, and I sell vials of alien cum. I know that's probably not <laughs> what you wanted to hear when you walked over here. You wanted cum or what? <laughs> Wait, hold, hold, hold the phone. What the fuck? You sell alien cum? I know it's gross, but calm down. My name is Stan, and I sell horrendous amounts of all sorts of alien cum. And we're just gonna have to live with that knowledge together now. Why are you here selling alien cum? Is there seriously an actual market for that? I consider it policy not to ask my clients why they want the gallons and gallons of alien cum they buy from me. I figure the less questions I ask about what people are doing with all this alien cum, the better. So, are you buying or nay? Should I? <laughs> Did we look like people that would want to buy alien cum? Sure. Look. <laughs> I have absolutely no idea. I'm shocked to my core every time somebody buys literally truckloads of alien cum from me. But they do it all the time. There's no rhyme or reason to it. I've been completely unable to narrow it down to a set of demographic. Grannies, cops, movie stars, politicians, everybody likes my delicious alien cum. I've had every type of weirdo coming up here saying, 
I lack 600 gallons of your absolute highest quality alien cum. And, and, and I say, does it matter which aliens the cum come from? And they say, no, sir, it truly does not. I just want some alien cum. No further details needed. So what? What's it going to be? You want some alien cum or not? All right, uh, listen, we thought it over, and we'll take some alien cum. Whoa, look at you. You want some alien cum. I'm so glad you're interested. Look, you caught me on a good day. I'm doing a promo one time off of free alien cum. Take some on the house, and if you like it, just come back and get some more. Just tell all your friends about oh, me. Fuck, give me Say a Stan gallon of alien has the cum. absolute best alien cum I've ever seen, <laughs> tasted, touched, whatever. I'm not sure if it's his or if he's getting it from some other alien, but I'm just such a huge fan of his work and what he's doing out there on the streets of Blam City selling alien cum to the community. Say all of that. Ah, looking for more alien nope. cum, no, are no, you? No, 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 well, no. I'm sorry. I'm fresh out of alien cum right now. We sell out early sometimes. I gotta go restock my supply, and that's not so easy, trust me. <laughs> but give me a little bit, and I'll have plenty more. I promise. I just, I just need some recovery time. <laughs> wow, you're really desperate for more alien cum, huh? Look, I done told you what I gotta tell you. I, I, it's gonna be a while, okay? You got my last drops of alien cum, and I just don't have any more yet. That's not how an uh, alien system of ejaculatory valves work, okay? Now, I wish I could help you, but I can't. <laughs> All right, hey, you're getting a little annoying, okay? Well, what are you, addicted to alien cum or something? I didn't even know that was possible. It's true what they say. You learn something new about alien cum every day. That's what makes it so great. But I don't have any more, so beat it. Want to hear something interesting? I got two brothers. One of them sells weird alien goop just like me over on Port Tarim. And we the better. other, he's ashamed of us. He hates goop. That guy doesn't like to be anywhere near goop. Thinks he's better than us because he doesn't sell goop. Fuck him. Oh, what's that smell? Oh, you must have met my brother in Dragtown. You let him cover you in his goop, right? Ha! Disgusting. I'm not even gonna tell you what it is. It's not cum, that's for sure. <laughs> so we have a gallon of alien cum now. Okay. They hung a I've been telling you to clean up. This place is a mess. I need you to clean it up before Tweet gets here. Oh, got a big date with your sad sack Flimborg boy toy? Fuck off, Gene. Like you've even never been on a date. Hey, don't even start, sister. I know a lot about dates. I fucked more aliens than your brain can comprehend. And even I don't <laughs> want to touch your boyfriend. I'm so sick of hearing about this guy. Yeah, right. My boyfriend is so fucking hot, though, right? Wait, you haven't even met him. Why are you calling him gross? You know I've got a whole life going on here. Well, you're off having fun doing whatever it is you do. No, you're right. Her boyfriend's ugly. Just clean up after yourself, Jesus. Hey, look, I'm sorry if I'm coming off harsh. He's messing up the group dynamic. We've got a good thing going here. We do that fun sitcom banter back and forth while your nibbling here goes and blasts alien baddies in the face. It's great! Dude, you're lucky you even get to live here with us. I don't care about your damn dynamics. I'm just saying you barely know this guy. Are you sure you're even attracted to him? Most aliens only bang their own species. Oh, what about you? You Stay just up. said you've slept with basically everything in the whole galaxy. Yeah, but I'm a washed-up degenerate. You've got your whole life ahead of you. That's more condescending than it is sweet. What? No, uh, look, we've spent all this time living together. I I care about you now, Leslie. For fuck's sake, my name's Lizzie. <laughs> Come on, tell her I care about her. Excuse me? <laughs> no, sorry, but I am not about to let <clears throat> this Fuck up degenerate, school me on life decisions. The fact that I'm a fuck up degenerate is exactly why you should let me school you on life decisions. Yeah? I, I know better than anyone what not to do. You're both assholes. Yeah? Well, you're gonna get this tweed guy pregnant, and then I'll be here to tell you I told you so. <laughs> then who's gonna have to deal with all your mutant kids running around this house? 
Me! Yeah, not that it matters, but I'm the one who would get pregnant. Not the way his species works. They get pregnant real easy. I'm so sick of this shit. Look, I just don't want Twig to think I'm messy, okay? It's that simple. And I don't want you dating him at all. Why don't I set you up with my nephew, Grimble Dick? He's got a steady Grimble job. <laughs> and yes, before you ask, he's got both his legs. That's not like a family ailment or anything. Fuck off! Just grow up and get used to me and Twig! Come on, tell Jean I can date whoever I want. I mean, she could date whoever she wants. Thank you! Not that I needed your approval. Oh, fine, yeah. Then why you team up against bitch? the depressed paraplegic? I didn't know you were depressed. I mean, I knew you were depressing. Har, har, har. <laughs> Just clean up, Jean, okay? Sorry to drag you into all that. Anyway, a nice little arrangement with Clug is paying off. They sent us intel on two new bounties. So, uh, go ahead if you want to get started on those. Yeah, you know, I appreciate you having my back, but uh, maybe your sister's right. Or not. What do I care? Team Gene, baby! He <laughs> said Team Gene. <laughs> hey, are we cool? You were kind of coming at me pretty hard during that argument. I mean, because you're and just remember, dating a like, fucking we're alien. siblings, right? And you're all I've got left this? right now. And Gene's a piece of shit. Oh, hey, another girl on the team. Good. Actually, I mean it. I'm not being snarky. That's so nice to see. Yeah, yeah, don't get too excited. We're not even the same species. I'm okay. Sorry we roped you into another argument. I want you to meet Tweed, by the way. I really think you'd like him. He's really nice to me and, well, he's helping me feel a little more normal. Even though his body doesn't make any fucking sense to me and he keeps trying to take me to restaurants that don't serve anything edible to humans, but... No, he's really sweet. So don't worry about me. You can focus on killing the space mafia or whatever. All right. Auction service out of Mayo, Wisconsin. Of course, conducting the auction out here for the Gleason State Bank as a secured party here on the Roy Anderson property. Harvey Woodward, of course, representing the home office out of Mayo. He's working here with me today, and Colonel Pete Van Ryan selling the auction. Been to either one of us, we'll roll along as rapidly as we can. All things are being sold here today without reservation. All items bills regarded as price, ordered by the clerks of the secured party. That includes all machinery, cattle, and the real estate. What is this? Oh. Should we go to the unknown sector? Let's check it out. Well, hey, this seems pretty nice. You know, I, I bet all the humans are really happy here. This place? I don't know. This place is cool. They gave us free air massages. I keep telling them it's not really something that humans like, but they keep offering them, so I keep taking them. We get 12 full meals a day. None of us have the heart to tell them we don't need to eat that much. You should. Oh, so let me let me get this straight. You like it here? Yep. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's a lot better than being trapped in a cage. You? Oh, yeah, same. I like it here a lot more. A lot more than being trapped in a cage. I tried reserving the sex room, but the waiting list is really long, and they only let one person in at a time. I don't think they know how sex we have room? sex. <laughs> what the fuck? There's a doctor here giving free checkups. Got my first physical in years. The doctor didn't really understand the human body, so I don't think it helped at all. But hey, free checkup. The toilets here are just out in the open. No dividers. But honestly, we all got used to it real quick. Now it's a fun thing like, hey, Toby's taking a shit. Let's all watch. What? So you're the one that's saving us all. I get it. All right. This fake ass image. Reinforce my ass. Beach up. Huh? Cornfield. Alabama. <laughs> All right. Look at chill.
Love it. More dialogue. No. Okay. Gary and Jill were up the hill, the best to pay the water. Gary fell down and broke his crown. Okay, let's go in order. And Jill came home to the Gary and Jill went up the hill. How much money did I have? Okay, well, no guarantees we're gonna save them again, but wh wh where are they? They're working in Screndel Labs now, just past the Mushroom Valley here. Just be careful, that place is freaky. Thanks! I know it's over there. Let me see if I can still get my crystals. Whoa, it looks like things have developed in a sort of weird way over here. Welcome to Highway Village. Our currency here is tires, and we sacrifice our younglings to the Lord Asphaltia, High God of the Way. What the fuck? At first we were scared. How did we end up here? Where were we? Should we leave our highway? And it turns out the answers in order as I asked them were, I don't know, I don't know, and definitely not. <laughs> It is true, we used to hate each other, honking and shouting, fuck you, back and forth, like animals, but now, we have found community and love. Okay. God damn, it's fucking hot! Hey, I'm the youngest one left alive. That means they're gonna sacrifice me to Lord Asphaltia tomorrow. I'm not too excited about it, to be honest, actually. Hey, I'm not even that much younger than everyone else. I'm 45 years old. I just happen to be the youngest by a couple of months. I know everyone's happy, but we did kill a lot of children in the name of a god we only made up within the last week. Isn't that crazy? Is guy taking a piss? Well, that's dude. Hello, friend. My old life was flawed. Now I live the way of the highway. <laughs> Lord Asphaltia provides for us. My by way which of the highway. I mean, sometimes a mite scurries up into our territory. We eat it, and it's so, so we don't die. They taste awful, but it helps us not die. You know, I didn't believe in Lord Asphaltia a few days ago, but. I mean, since then, we, we've made him up, and I'm like, uh, I, I'm a believer, for sure, and for sure and forever, Lord Asphaltia, Are they for to clown sure beliefs? and forever. I'm 
else? Let's go. Shit, did, did something happen to them? Again? I mean, did you not hear what the dude said? <laughs> Power slide! Nothing here, I think. Maybe we could check out the sacred grounds where we saved Prince Chosen One, you know? That's probably where we should go. You know, hint, hint. Yes, I can still grab this. Yes. Put a whole movie. <laughs> Haunted finger. Long neck finger later. Oh, you actually. Okay. Oh, hey, a movie's starting. You know, we deserve a break. L let's watch. L let's sit down and watch. It's starting. Nice and comfy. So guys, what are we watching today? <clears throat> I don't know. It's just a black screen right now. But I'm, I'm very, uh, very anxious. What does it say, Rich? It says... Are those guys really going to just talk the whole time? Demon winds. Oh, I can hear wind. That's the demon wind. <laughs> are you sure it's not an unrelated wind? Oh my goodness gracious. Uh, my grandfather went the exact same way. I ain't really gonna watch one of my guys. Yeah, you know what? That's, 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 that's enough of that. It was a lot more common back then, right? Uh, I don't know. It's always nice to take a break, you know, but eventually you gotta get back to the adventure, you know? Good use. Nice. We're really flying, huh? Really cool stuff, Bounty Hunter. Like, we're flying. Okay, this definitely must be the right way because, you know, we, we, uh, we, we haven't gone this way yet, you know? Fuck yeah, sweezy time. All right. 
What was the point of this? Oh, that's the one there. What the fuck? Shot, you know? Damn, man! I was hoping we could just slow down for a second. G3 doesn't stand a chance. Beyond the stars. yet right because it's it's really important I get you checked in and it's also really important that I finish shitting <laughs>
was there. Yeah. Launched over there. Right? Yeah. Sniper. this damn jetpack nothing down there right all right you know sometimes it's nice to just fly around you know who can all right strindle labs dead ahead Zipline to cross? It's like a planetic, bro. What up, Lily? Mute. I'm not mute. It shows my thing's working. I'm tired. No. Not really. I'm not really tired. I sound tired though. <clears throat> oh, shit. There's nothing interesting in this game has happened so far. Some funny shit. Still trying to get hyped up. So, uh, oh, you know, wh what do you think Scrando Labs is like? I mean, I, I, mean, like, I, I know a little bit. I mean, I, I, I heard a bit. So, so I kind of know. But I, I'm just making small talk right now. You know, I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to fill the dead air. It's really uncomfortable. I mean, don't get mad at me if what I'm saying <laughs> isn't that interesting because you know I'm, I'm doing my best here. You know. So not interesting, bro. Excuse me. 
Aha, we found it. This shit. Alright. I got me a new bitch. Alright, finally! It's this been one. a hot second! I like to explore everything before I go on. The gas elevator. But are we supposed to go? No, we're supposed to go there. Okay. And there. Let's check out here. But I can't go in here. Yet. That's right. Hello and welcome to Scranda Labs. Oh, Only thank authorized you. Thank personnel you. are allowed beyond this point. You gotta be kidding me! It's fucking Helen. Helen. Oh, you're the bounty hunter who helped us out with all that paperwork and killed my boss, Krubus. <laughs> we really appreciated that. But sorry, I need to let the G3 know that you're here. Just my job. Nothing personal. You're uh, gonna set off the alarm. Yep, I'm gonna set off the alarm. We've got an intruder. Fucking red. Jeez. We are coming for you. Sorry. It's my job. And I don't care about you. No, come on. Would you stop with the killing I'm for a bit? Sorry, but they pay me to tell them the intruders show up, so I do it. But do you get paid? Oh, shit. Here they come. You know, hey, at least the elevators are working now. What's up, running? Can't go in there. Sorry. Damn it! Missed that. Wait, so what was this then? Oh, that didn't work. What is this? These 
are annoying elevators. Really, not the best design for an elevator. Hey, take the hits, but please don't fall. I don't care if you die, I just don't want to climb all the way back up here. I thought they'd blow up. place you know see what kind of experiments they're doing here holy shit what are they doing to them are are, are they dead This was one of your friends, Bounty Hunter. I, I bet it was one of your best friends. That's what I just get this weird feeling, you know. I bet it was one of your best friends. No. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, well that's unsettling. Thanks. Have a good day. Welcome to Scrandall Labs, a proud division of Team Three R and D. Check all there, so. The Brothers are very smart. Ow. Ow. Sheesh, whoever works here really needs to get their shit together. What a mess. Hello, Jonathan. It's Dr. Gurgill. I've been asked to send you some of my findings on the human genome. It's only a small portion, and I doubt you'll even be able to comprehend what you're looking at. But I promised your mantuas I'd provide them. And now please don't contact me again. <laughs> I'm busy. Those Gatlians? I think I'm gonna be sick. A big ass Gatlian. Wait, I think that one's alive. Oh my god, that's. I wonder if he's. Never mind, never mind. We gotta move. No. Oh, hey! You look nice! 
name's Creature. The bad guys did experiments on me and fucked me up real bad in basically every way you can imagine. Holy shit, am I glad to see another cat laying alive in here. Uh, are there any others? Oh my god, yes, there's so many. Oh, but unless you've been alive, then no. These fucking G3 <laughs> bastards. Creature, we're taking on the cartel. You want in? Oh, no, no, no. They take good care of me. Holding me against my will, cutting me open, doing experiments on me. Okay, you know what? Say it out loud. I think they might actually be bad. I'm part of your team now. Hell yeah. Welcome aboard, uh, creature. Th 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 that's your name? I guess so. Oh, hey, we're locked in. But that's fine. Don't freak out or anything. I can give birth to a bunch of little freaks and they can disable the door lock. It's fine. All right. Oh, yeah, that's one of my children. They die fast. Don't worry. It's easy to make more. And it feels... Ah, beautiful. Look how one of my little fuckers just saved us. <laughs> Being a dad is the best feeling in the world. Then a few seconds later, when your mutant kid dies because it has a microscopic lifespan, that's... Not so good of a feeling, actually, but I'm numb to it. Oh, yeah, that's one of my children. They died fast. Don't worry, it's easy to make more, and it feels good. God, I love them so much. What comes back? up without asking it's just you should use me here what the? this is our best human fergal hybrid specimen it may not be as cool as our subject in the weapons lab but it's still rather beautiful isn't it we call it a fur man or, or maybe a hurdle we haven't disgusting. decided yet why am I telling you all this? You know, to be honest, it's because you look cool and a little bit badass, to be frank. It's good. It's a good experiment that I think is actually just a dead human with a Fergal on top. Who's the scientist here? Me or you, huh? <laughs> they grow up so fast, then they die. It's pretty rough being a dad. Do not recommend it. I've had so many kids and I'm gonna have so many more. What's that one do? So what does the L2 do? You ever have kids? I recommend it. It's the greatest feeling in the world. Hurts to give birth to him though. I don't understand the difference. R1. Would you like to do the honors? We're going to try to show up those cocky nerds in the weapons lab by fusing this human with some other aliens. Just hit the button. You're, you're okay with letting us help? Look, I can do it myself if you don't want to. I'm just trying to be nice. Let's do this one. Are you fucking kidding me? That wasn't supposed to happen. They died! What the fuck are you doing? Well, why, why'd you press the button, bounty hunter? <laughs> All right. Do that though.
Oops. And it can dance. Why is it not letting me kill? You know, your holster's not as much fun as you might think. Holy shit, you killed everyone? What? You are strong. Good thing I'm safe behind this glass. Oh! Use one of my kids to fuck with that guy's mind. He'll go into a frenzy. Did I tell you they can do that? They can do that. That guy used to do especially bad experiments on him. Thing. What the hell, man? Dude couldn't even defend himself! Sorry. Well, not really. I think I earned the right to fight back by getting tortured and experimented on so much. Hey, Brian, how you doing? You think Brian? I'm gonna answer your questions? <laughs> I would so shoot you right now if I wasn't strapped on this operating table. guys we just killed and I can promise you they were all 100% evil oh oh and if you keep oh, piling that's my what kids on top of a guy they can do mind control shit they can make a bad guy fight for us oh shit that mind control thing doesn't last very long sorry about that I keep yelling at my kids to make it last longer but they're shitheads they do not listen Sorry for killing you, but you shouldn't have joined the people that destroyed my home planet. Tight crate whenever they take me outside. I really <laughs> liked it. Oh, I 
could help you with that little hook bug hide. Shoot my little guys in there. What the fuck was that? Look at my little guy in there rustling up the hive. Isn't that cute? I'm so proud of him. <laughs> What is? Little cutie. Look at his little booty. Hey, hey this is fun. Do you do this sort of stuff all the time, bounty hunter? Yeah. Heard about it. Come on, come on, come on, save us. Why does it do that? Oh, I wasted it all. G3 bodies. Listen, bounty hunter, you wanna maybe you try using clutch the arms to save those humans? Help us. Oh my god, a politician oh. who actually gives a shit. Hey, let's save those humans. I don't know. I don't think it's saving them. Be free, little humans. Be free. Oh shit. Ah, breath of fresh air to see all these humans we've been saving just having a nice chill time. Try to go through that.
just come to hell in here and fuck with me? You know who I am? I'm trying to fucking Strendel, a.k.a. the high Strendel brother. Up yours! Up oh, yours. hey, Jonathan. I think we're gonna kill you. Take a drink of that. Ready. I was supposed to go up there with him. I was fighting him. I didn't even do that. <laughs> Alright. That's what we Oh, that's where I was. Alright. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Creature, we need your talents. It's one of your things. That's Angela Screndel. Wanna kill him? Oh fuck! The bounty hunter's here! Oh, Angela's leaving. I guess he's busy. Bye, Angela! Stop recouping!
be needing this. Power sliding. Oh, man. I'm so, I am supposed to go there. Don't <laughs> yet. Don't do yet. right out of my ass. I love them all. God, I love them so fucking much. My fucked up little boys. The people in charge here are mad because they're not human. Nobody really knows what species these things are, but I love them anyway. I mean, how, how could I not? How, how could a father not love his fucked up little alien spawn? It's impossible. I got this. Hell yeah. They want us to bang, but she uh, used to be my boss. Yeah, I was supposed to fire her, and then we all got abducted by aliens. <laughs> anyway, yeah, we're not attracted to each other. I mean, she's cool, but not my type. And she I is mean, my type, but she's not cool. I'm all over this. Yeah, y'all should do it. I'm all over too. Be free, little humans! Be free! I guess it's supposed to be porn, but it's like alien porn, so I, I don't know. I, I honestly have no idea what I'm watching. I mean, I was able to get off to it, like, after a while. Um, honestly, now I love it, though. Uh, not sure why they want me to jack off this much, but, you know, I'm happy to do it. Like, all the tentacles and the moving parts, it's, I don't know, there's something really endearing about it. Yeah, I, I like it a lot, actually. I mean, if, if I ever get out of here, I, I hope I can, like, bring this with me, at least. I mean, I, I don't even think I could go back to normal porn after this. All right! <laughs> Uh, nice. A little disturbing. Why would I need to What's open going down? this? Oh, okay. Man. Wait, what? Come close. 
closer. I, I don't bite. Don't worry. I'm on a break. I just want to enjoy my lunch. Fuck. Come over here. You look starving. Take your time. Take your time. Take your time. Best to see all the options. Just don't try to eat them, because they are not food. To a health toaster. All day, hungry people come Damn. up to me, begging for food, clawing at me for food. And I just have to tell them, no, I just sell bullshit. No food. It's just a sad buy them all bullshit them. cafeteria. Thanks for buying that, even though it's not food. Even though we don't Why sell is it food, cheese, bro. You got it, Haas. All yours. Look, it's not just because we're in a cafeteria. I'm... You got a big appetite, don't you? Not for sexual use. Stop asking. Hey, you look like you have good taste. I bought all your Bye, shit, man. Damn, you got me broke. You have good taste. Shut the fuck up. Make sure it's not the taste buds sort of taste, the food taste, because we don't have that. We don't have food. The Scrindles won't let me sell food no matter how much I ask. Uh, Ready, that. willing, and able. Not just because we're in a cafeteria. I want to sell food. I oh, love food. But the Scrindles won't just. Hey, asshole, we can see you hiding in there. No, you can't. Fuck off. To be honest with me, it confuses you that there's a shop in the cafeteria that doesn't sell food. I thought that goes through. No rush, Hoss. You can uh. hang here all day. Or more. Sweezy, ready for bed! Fuck you! Ah! Oh, sorry, we can stop chasing you if you'd like! Hey, listen, I keep asking the higher-ups, can we sell food? Can we start to sell food? We're in a cafeteria! But they just don't listen to me. They... That's it! There's no more running! I wasn't running! Yes, you were! Whatever! Fuck you!
Do I really need to be launched up here? It's like Christmas morning! Alright, so... It's just fucked. It's just fucked, really. Good, delicious. Now let me dig into the last bro. Oh, fuck 
yes, three in one sitting. Each one more visually better than the last. You know what? I don't see this often, but I'm fully sated right now. I actually need a rest. <laughs> Fuck, it's Garmantuous? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I know who you are, and I want you to know how fuck you've made things for yourself. You were living in heaven before you meddled with the G3. Fuck you, you're just afraid because we keep killing off your goons. Bounty Hunter, I've got the two most important people in your life, and I'm going to kill them. <laughs> oh, but not right away. First, I'll make things miserable for them. They're going to suffer as much as you've made me suffer. You monster! I'm not going to ask you to stop. I doubt you'd listen. I'd just like to inform you that I'm going to make sure you die. And that it's going to hurt. <laughs> A lot. <laughs> Besides, you won't even be able to get to my new base on Earth without the proper coordinates. So just sit tight until I come to kill you myself. Fuck, guess we've really awakened the beast now. All right, well, you know, we never did figure out, you know, who's the boss uh, uh, of those guys. But, you know, let's pack it in and, and head home. Killed the Screndel brothers and freed us again. Thank you. Thank you. Everyone else is too traumatized to talk right now. Sorry. We just keep getting captured over and over again, you know? It's a lot to take in. I'm still able to talk because I've been captured the most. I'm just kind of numb to it now. Means nothing to me anymore. Don't worry about us. We'll find our way home. We just need a minute to catch our breaths and recover from all the trauma. It's a lot of trauma. Trust me. I'm an expert in being traumatized. Okay, seems like you want some kind of reward or something. Uh, yes. Because uh, we don't really have any rewards for you. We've been held prisoner for a bit, and we don't really have anything. I know you got some so, uh, thank you. Is that enough? Ooh, actually, you know what? The trauma's catching up with me. I'm gonna need to dive deep inside my psyche for a bit and not talk anymore until my brain's all leveled out. I'm not gonna say anything anymore. None of us are. If that feels weird, remember, it's just because we're irreparably traumatized. Would you chill out? They don't need to die. fire aren't you mm. obviously you're not as good at bounty hunting as i used to be but hey yes. i'm glorpy enough to admit you're doing pretty damn well turn in that bounty great another gadlian how many more can you hold i feel like we're hitting the upper ceiling here yeah i'm creature i'm all fucked up so good to meet you all right you know the drill by now turn in that bounty standing there admiring a legend like me, but, uh, you gotta turn in that bounty. Yeah. I actually wanted to run something by you. How would you feel about me maybe fixing up my old bounty hunting ads, maybe putting you in them to drum up business? I mean, my name will still be bigger than yours in the logo, but... We'd be stupid not to capitalize on your growing reputation. Yo, you guys are fresh out of Frendelos. <laughs> oh, hey, I I'm Tweeg. I'm dating your sister. Uh, this fucking guy. Tweeg, you need to leave. Um, Lizzie says it's cool if I'm here. You just gonna let this sack of shit eat all my Frendelos and tongue kiss your sister? I'm the one who bought those fucking Frendelos. And leave Tweeg alone. You know he has a barbed tongue and he's very sensitive about it. I can go. No, Tweeg. You're staying. Tell him he's staying. Look, he doesn't even love you. He's just after our house. It's our 
house. Exactly. Hey, Twink, <laughs> you gotta be careful around Lizzie. She's just gonna hit it and quit it. <laughs> Heartbreaker. I'd get out now while you're still in the green. And hey, you want a real lover? Talk to me. Don't you have a galaxy to fuck? Come on, tell him to leave. Fuck. Thank you. I appreciate it. But honestly, it's my house too. So I don't even know why I have to fight for this. I'm just so pissed at everyone. Oh. Not you, Twig. I love you, baby. Ah! Disgusting! Look at this! They're not even the same species! Do, do you know how many holes he has? And they're all really advanced level holes. Advanced you level holes? My nephew instead. His holes are more your speed. Shut the hell up, Gene. I am sick of your shit. All you do is sit on our couch and mope about how sad your life is. You're a leech trying to eat all of our friendalos and use the only family I have left to relive your glory days. Hey! Your family's doing a great job! You know how hard it is to kill that many high-level bounties in such a short amount of time? I mean, it's not as fast as I could have done it, but, uh... I know they're doing a great job, and I'm proud of them. But I'm stuck here dealing with you all the time, and you're fucking pathetic! Tell him how pathetic he is. <laughs> I don't want to be fucked up. Hey, come on. Don't make it sound so sad. Look, I admit I wasn't in a good place when you found me, but I feel like I'm part of your family now. I'm basically your dad now. You too, Relax. Lizzie. I'm your dad. I'm just worried about you dating this weird freak who just wants to steal my couch away from me. Is that it? You can call it your couch when you start paying rent. Until then, no complaining about who lives here. Lives here? He's gonna live here? I mean, if you think we're ready, Twig. Oh, yeah, sure. Hey, shut up, Twig. This isn't about you. Why? Because you're worried you'll have to share a cushion? No! Because I... Because I'm concerned! You barely know this guy. And it's dangerous out there for humans. Oh, that's rich and condescending. I am not an idiot. I know what I'm doing. You're cool with Twig moving in, right? Hell yeah! That's the right call! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tweet's a creep! You think I'm a creep? You are a creep. Everybody better stop calling my boyfriend a creep. Effective immediately. You know, I just didn't realize I was a creep. Ugh, that's enough of this. Twig, let's go to the park. To... <laughs> to... to kiss? <laughs> yeah. Anybody got a fucking problem with that? Eesh. Sorry I said anything. Let's just get back to the bounty hunting. Can't wait to show you those new commercials. Just in here. Yeah, I'm out. I'll be back on later.